you don't remember, then how do you know that you didn't try to take your life? Because I know I wouldn't do that. I know what you want me to say. What do you think I want you to say? That they took advantage of me because I was only 13. Well, do you think they took advantage of you? No. They got you drunk with the intention of having sex with you. Look, they had been married for like 100 years. They needed something to spice it up. Did you have any feelings for either one of them? I liked him better. And where is he now? He killed himself. He was a little crisscross strokes. <laughs> you can add more of the black, you can gray it down, and even brighter. It all depends on you. <laughs> you want to paint my nails for me? Taste <laughs> It, is it at all possible that you cannot be a skank for one second when I'm watching my show? <laughs> no. Get off my fucking couch. Make me. Hey. Can I come in? Do you want a cigarette? I didn't smoke. Well, you might as well. Is there anything else to do around here? You know, I can get you whatever you want. What do you think I want? Money. Sex. Fun. You want to get high? Are you insane? You know, Mike, Mr. Nurseman, See, I blow him, and he gives me whatever I want. <laughs> Trust me. The first time I tried to commit suicide, I was 16. I got pregnant and had to have an abortion. I didn't have any money and I couldn't tell my parents so I had to have it done by this guy who said he could do it real cheap but he messed up and now I can't have kids so I uh, hear Elizabeth here's a little thought for you <laughs> every time you walk into the room I want to take your fucking face and smash it against the ground